Well, this is really what not to do uh, while on the uh, street. Uh, this is a road rage incident, apparently, that happened out in Houston. Um, I got to tell you, uh, this was not well conceived, uh, to say the least. It seems from what the information that's coming out that I guess there was an altercation on the road. There was some road rage incident, and uh, these two vehicles pulled over, and well, you can see for yourself what, what happened next. I'm not sure whether, you know, what the circumstances were leading up to this, nor whether the person in the vehicle had a firearm or whatever. I, I, I can't speak to that. What I can say is, based solely on the stuff that I'm seeing, this is extraordinarily irresponsible and stupid. You know, in Florida, you're allowed to defend yourself and, and your life against somebody who's creating a threat, you know, an imminent threat to your, you know, well-being and to your, to your safety and to your life. Uh, in this case, I can't say that I see any of that, uh, again, based solely on what I'm seeing here. Uh, it looks as though, you know, there was a scuffle, there was an argument, uh, the gentleman got out of the vehicle and tried to escalate that argument, and then the female passenger got out and shot a shot of, uh, into, the, uh, into the back of the other person's vehicle. That person flees, and then she shoots again. That's the part where, you know, even if there was something to be said about maybe the other person had a firearm or was, you know, threatening, um, at that point, the threat subsided. You're just pretty much shooting at a dealership at this point. So I, I don't know. I, I think that her, per, her defense attorney is going to have a really tough time uh, showing this. Um, thanks a lot to uh, PPV Tahoe for, uh, for the video. I, I got this off of his Instagram. You guys should definitely go give him a like and a subscribe. And speaking of subscribing, uh, please, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe and hit the notification icon down, down there for uh, more uh, you know, content from me. Um, now, that said, it seems as though as far as an update's concerned on this issue, it seems as if she was arrested. She was arrested for... Uh, aggravated battery or aggravated assault i'm sorry now i think here in florida she'd definitely get an aggravated assault but with a deadly weapon but i think she might also be on the hook for attempted murder i mean i guess the case could be made um definitely discharging the weapon irresponsibly there's there's a whole slew of stuff that she might be on the hook for um so with time i guess we'll see how this pans out once it gets to the uh prosecutor but in the meantime this is where we're at now what can i tell you guys you know we're in Miami, at least I'm in Miami. The roads are congested. They're getting worse, okay? There's a lot of people coming from other parts of the country, and every day it's getting crazier and crazier. I can't drive out there at 1 p.m. without, you know, running into a slew of traffic. What can I tell you? Namaste, okay? Uh, resign yourself to the fact that there is traffic and you are probably going to be late if you left the house thinking uh, that you were going to be on time. <laughs> um, things happen, and... Unfortunately, this is not the way to handle it. Just be on the lookout. There are going to be people on their phones. It's aggravating. There are going to be people, be people out there that you know might want to get into your lane and just, just completely disrespect you. It's going to happen. So how you handle it, I mean, if you handle it like this lady did, you could be looking at the rest of your life in jail. So don't let that small uh, moment define the rest of your life. And be careful out there. Again, the road's there for everybody. We're all equally entitled to it, even though most of us can't drive. Um, just like I said, if you want to get home uh, at safe and sound to your family, relax. Again, there's no rush. Just take your time and, and get to where you're going safely, okay? That was uh, my uh, dad advice. And uh, if you'd like more of it, again, like I said, please subscribe. Well, thanks so much, guys. Have a great one and look, look forward to talking to you soon. Take care.